North Carolina Division of Services for the Blind. We have a lot to offer. Thank you for calling AudioVox Technical Support. My name is Kyle. May I begin with your telephone number or area code first, please? Kyle is as consistent as the sun rising in the morning. I am a technical support representative. He's here, rain or shine. The level of support that he provides is always excellent. Now press your power button or on. He has some braille assistive technology. He also uses a software called uh, JAWS. And that software is JAWS for Windows. And that screen reader provides speech output, which means I can hear what is on the screen but it also supports the Braille display, so anything that changes on the screen, I can touch by feeling the Braille display. The impact on his work is virtually zero. He is at least as productive as any of our other employees. He's one of the best employees we have, period. I started here at Shoulder in February of 2006. I've been here since. One of the goals here at Shelter is to teach other people how to teach. Ron is a dynamic leader. He presents to the students an example of somebody who has worked hard and overcome a number of physical challenges, and at the same time doesn't use those challenges as an excuse to do anything other than his best. He actually manages a lot of the Braille site that we have here, so he does that. He works with our interns and with the students and outreach. They really enjoy him as well. In many cases, Ron's visual impairment isn't even noticed by a number of the individuals that interact with him. Just wrapping it around the Left, Kim's office. Good girl. For my staff, it, it was a little bit of a challenge for them to get used to somebody being here with a dog, um, maybe knowing how to help her and things that she could do for herself that she didn't really need the extra help. It's just a matter of reaching a balance of, of respect, and there are times when I do need help, of course. I'm, I'm blind, I can't do certain things, but there's a lot of things that I can do. And guys, if I'm going downhill or uphill, you need to tell me. Though she's given some things that are adaptable, she's still required to do all the same things that other peer support specialists do, and she does. And it's just been a wonderful team effort for me to get this, this job here, this employment here, this purpose to my life. And uh, the folks here have adapted very well to Deborah, and they're very pleasantly surprised that we have somebody that's sight challenged that works as a peer support specialist, but they say that's also something they like about our company. Glad to have her, because it's, it's made me grow as well. The state has been very good to us. On occasions, Ron's equipment needed to be upgraded, and the state stepped in and helped us do that. We receive assistance from the Division of Services of the Blind from North Carolina. They do a great job, and so um, in exchange for having a great employee, it may as well cost us nothing to have them here. It's fantastic. If you're in a position to hire people with disabilities, give them a chance, give them an opportunity. Open your hearts, open your minds. We have a lot to offer. For information, call the North Carolina Division of Services for the Blind at 866-222-1546.